Hi everyone, it's Adrian Leah. Happy 200 subscribers on my channel. Thank you so much for your time and wanting to watch my videos. I wanted to do a reading video where you can pick a card and I'll put the time slots at the bottom or in the description bar for you to see if you pick the first card, second card, or third card. So the deck that I'm using is my deck. It's the Earth Theory Tarot. So I'm going to show card one, which is the seven of pentacles. And you can see that it's a fox in winter trying to get what's underneath the snow. And is it even worth it? I am getting that there is a bit of time constraint here, wanting to resurface what has been underneath for so long. I feel like that there is some epiphany that was there. Also learning, working harder. There may be another direction to take, which wasn't your first option but it may be the one for you and it that thought hasn't been realized yet the second card is the tower and the tower is an interesting card because I feel like it's one where it's abrupt and intense. With this, I'm getting take it or leave it. There is a mermaid there, and it could be questioned whether she's getting that opportunity or she's running away from it. Overall, there is a light bulb situation where it struck you to a point where there's awareness. This could also be a welcoming opportunity, also an ending. I'm getting that it wasn't expected. There's a lot of emotions that are being portrayed right now. But it looks like it's surface level. It doesn't look like it's really what the main expression is. That there's something that's deeper than that. Then the third card is the Knight of Pentacles. And I'm getting that there's something pulling, but in a way where it's thread-like, where it's pulling too hard to a point where either it's going to break or you need to loosen your grip. This could be taking your time and standing your ground. There is a big perspective in this and you can see that the t um, tall trees could be perceived as Scott's pine. Also, with the eyes glowing, it feels like there's going to be an inner vision where you're going to see how the past influences the future and how to live out your present. 
Things are definitely aligning here. The main thing is patience, which can be difficult, but for the Knight of Pentacles, it serves him well. He's definitely more of the grounded ones compared to the other knights. And with this, the last message I'm getting is clear path. And if you don't know the path that you're going to take, look for signs. And third eye. So those were the messages. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that this was helpful. Um, thank you for, again, watching my videos, and I hope you'll watch future videos. Bye, guys.